Hello there, welcome back to the new lecture. So in this lecture, we will show you how to prepare bill of quantity for electrical service. So here you can see the service BOQ. Uh, now, here the serial number is given, material code if you have. So that code you have to write down service code in description. You need to give the detailed description. Here write down the detailed description. Then see the rate, quantity as per standard BOQ amount, okay, quantity as per design. So our main target here we have to fill this column. Quantity, whatever we have calculated now for mall project. So here we have to write down the quantity as per design BOQ. Then amount as per market price that will enter, okay, amount and everything. So that is, this is amount and rate, it is based on the market price. Our main target is to fill the quantity as per design. So here, when you see, just scroll down, see the LV switch gear. So in our project, we are not using, so leave it as it is, okay. Uh, here installation, testing and commissioning of various distribution boat wall mounted ip 42 degree of protection double door okay it is given here as per sld so that also we have to fill that i will explain you later come here the first thing is here see the installation and commissioning of ups okay so in our project if you see i will just open the layout equipment layout in that you have seen now i think uh ups location is shown in this electrical room and their capacity is also given 15 kilovolt ampere ups so you have to see here uh in description you have to write down the detail description of ups okay and see the different capacity is given so in our project we have 15 kilovolt ampere ups mm -hmm. see the unit is given what number so write down the quantity in the quantity as per design boq only one ups of 15 kilovolt ampere we have so just write down that quantity one okay same way scroll down here uh, you will get now the detail of lighting db if you are using lighting db so all of you know that in our project when when i open the electrical equipment see here uh, how many number of so here it is given otherwise you can also open the x already i have prepared the schedule if you remember okay so in our project we are using two lighting db one is of eight way tpn and one lighting db of 12 way tpn db okay so same here we have to fill that detail see lighting db eight way tpn so their quantity is needed here so write down their quantity See 8 way ETP and DB with PPI kits 1 32 amps TPM their quantity is needed 32 amps so for that now if you want to find out their quantity so open the SLD layout and let's see lighting this is our so here you can see first uh, for we are talking about 8 way now this is our 8 way TP and DB so here you can see uh, we have a 32 amps TPN MCB their quantity is 1 so I am writing here 32 TPN MCB quantity is 1 ok 8 way TPN DB calculate uh, that quantity I have written 1 now 32 amps double pole 230 volt residual current circuit breaker how many you have so just open the SLD you will get the idea see here we have a 32 amps db double pole rccb quantity one two three so just write down your three quantity okay then 10 amps single pole mcb is how much so same open the sld layout see uh one two three four five six six here then six here and six here total 18 okay so same i have written here now come for next lighting db 12 with tp and db so for 12 way when you open this is our 12 way tpn db 
so here also we 4 amps tpn mcb is one quantity 4 amps double pore rcb is three quantity so same i have written here one and uh, 40 amps double pore three quantity that is given here 10 amps single pole how much 30 we have written because see when you open the sld here see 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so 10 here 10 here 10 here so total 30 number of 10 amperes 10 amps single pore mcb we are using so their quantity i have written here same way for power power db for so we have one 12 way tpn db or two i don't know the quantity so for that open the schematic means this sld layout so when, when you see in sld layout we have power distribution board 12 way tpn again we have a 12 way tpn so and then finally 6 way tpn db so power distribution board of 12 way tpn we have two quantity okay so in excel sheet you have to write down here in power db 12 way tpn the quantity is two okay then 63 amps tpn mcb is how much so same way uh, one is here and one is here 60 63 amps tpn db okay so total two na 63 amps tpn mcb one is here one is here so just write down their quantity two okay then 63 double pole rccb is how much so it is around six see that i will show you see 63 amps double pole rccb one two three then here also we have four five six so just their quantity i have written here six then same way 16 amps single pole mcb we are using total 60 it is showing yes because see in each phase 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so 10 10 20 10 30 40 50 60 so here i have written 60 same way for power db if you are using six way tpn their quantity everything you have to write down okay it is very simple then uh, we have a ups db also 16 way spn ups db so their detail their quantity so for that you have to open this sld layout it is important so for ups dbc we have 16 way spn ups db and one 12 way spn ups db for 16 way here we have one 16 3 amps double pole mcb then one 63 amps double pole rccb and then one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve 16 m s single pole mcb so their quantity i have written here okay one 12 way spn db then 16 m double pole mcb then 16 m double pole rccb quantity one and eight quantity i have written for 16 m single pole miniature breaker means mcb eight quantity total okay don't need to just because uh, uh, we have the circuit is up to seven circuit is in use one we are using for spare okay so just eight 16m sp single pore mcb same way for ups db2 here we have a 12 way spn db so you have to fill the detail okay their quantity then inverter db if you are using their quantity is needed here so in sld here see this is our inverter where it is see inverter db 12 way spn inverter db okay so their total how many double pole mcb you are using so their quantity is needed so that i have written here okay you have to fill this detail so here in our case only we are using 12 way inverter spn db we are not using 8 way just leave it as it is okay so you have to fill the detail this all detail now same way for this one ups inverter db also yeah of course we are using so that total detail is needed so where is 
see ups in inverter gv eight way spn so their detail i have filled here okay one eight way spn db we have and their quantity 63 amps double pore mcb we have four quantity i have written okay now vtp and db also we are using means main db so in sld when you open here you will get that also see this is our 12 way vtp and db which is our main db so you have to find out the mcb 16 3 amps triple pole mcb is how much okay their quantity you have to write down here then finally come here see the supply installation testing and commissioning of inverter so in our project if you see i will show you the equipment layout here we have placed the inverter also where see in this electrical room and what is the capacity 5 kilovolt ampere so write down in the excel sheet when you are preparing the boq see we have a different size but how much capacity of inverter we have 5 kilovolt ampere their quantity i have written one correct same way when you come here the cable which type of cable you are using see the cable tray and conduit detailing is so generally we are using perforated cable tray okay different size because two size is given see i will show you the cable tray layout uh, basically we are using 30 300 by 50 perforated cable their quantity 68 meter and 150 by 50 perforated cable quantity 48 68 48 so i am writing here this is our 68 total and 48 150 by 50 is 48 running meter I, because see here the unit is written meter so i have given the value same way other types of cable tray if you are using so that detail is needed here correct so i have written supply installation testing and commissioning of perforated cable tray gi okay their detail is given now in this next cable raceway of 16 sv swg gi solid with gi cover of uh, sld signal cable with all accessories yeah for the installation of cable tray the accessories and everything so okay same 60 their quantity you have to write down say so here just remove it okay for all accessories for suspending from ceiling with support at the rate of one meter okay at every one meter we have to play give the support and everything so their quantity you have to write on here okay then next uh, come here see the supply and laying of xlpe insulated pvc outer sheet inner exterior pvc sheet armored stranded aluminium conductor cable of 1.1 kilowatt class cable is part okay so their total detail 3 core 10 square mm aluminium cable how much their running meter we have to write down 4 core 16 square mm cable running meter so i have written here this detail you will get i think uh, i have already prepared the cable schedule so in the schematic only see here in this cable schedule i have written you can see three core 10 square mm aluminium three core 10 square aluminium total how much we have 85 see 3 core 10 square mm aluminium armored xlp cable total we have 85 running meter so i have written see the where we are using F the cable which you are running from 6 kilovolt ampere ups to ups outgoing mcb their quantity or see ups outgoing mcb to ups inverter db running meter 55 so as per that you have to write down the quantity of cable like this correct then uh, here also cable quantity after that see the cable terminal table quantity everything you have to fill this detail then the see you have to just write down the see sitc means supply installation testing commissioning of 6 m 3 pin switch and socket 
so their quantity if you remember just write down okay then 6 or 16 amps uh, 5 pin switch and socket okay then power point for light box how much so in our project i think we have calculated the power point and everything total how much 60 we have power point na? so their quantity i have written here 60 and total switch 6m 3 pin switch and socket how much 134 quantity is given here so okay open the power point here 134 just count it it is 134 after that next 6 or 16 and 5 pin switch okay first 15 here then 52 okay i think 52 one minute huh? total is 6 or 16 amps one minute 6 supply installation testing commissioning 6 or 16 amps 5 pin switch and socket 79 they have given here the quantity is 79 actually exact is not given here which type of socket it is 134.79 so one minute huh? 15 plus 69 plus 52 5 12 okay actually here the quantity which is written is wrong okay you have to just see it in your project how much you are using 6 m 3 pin switch and socket whatever you are using so their quantity is needed here okay so just open the powerpoint layout and here you will get the idea from here just calculate and write down the quantity here correct same way powerpoint for light box 60 whatever you have calculated now <clears throat> here this see supply installation testing and commissioning of power sub main circuit wiring so the, here the wiring quantity we have to write down so that already i have calculated here see lighting and power circuit boqc 2 into 2.5 plus 1 into 1 1.5 square mm for lighting circuit and 6 m power socket outlet how much we have calculated total here 4778 same way the for power socket outlets their dimension is given 1725 so just write down that detail 4780 1725 okay we have calculated circuit wiring detail the, uh, and then finally see the lighting fixture which you are using in your project so already you can see here we have calculated the quantity of lighting fixtures whatever types of lighting we are using now see in description their name is given and quantity so same we have to fill here okay and then junction box how much how many junction box you are using so for that you have to open the conduit layout here see the junction box 23 near above so just fill it it is written 25 so 23 total we have okay then uh, as bill drawing made on AutoCAD of the total work executed include six set of blueprint okay so their quantity rubber then supply installation of rubber mat quantity globes quantity first aid box okay this detail you have to fill in this way generally we have to prepare the BOQ for electrical service okay so I hope all of you enjoy the session see you in next one